Did you know it has been 20 years since the movie The Big Lebowski came out? Yep, it came out in 1998. Now, every night on our show, as you just saw, we send McKinsey out to an event that is happening right now. But today, we wanted to give you a heads up on an event that's coming up tomorrow, so maybe you'll stop by. Tomorrow at the Pendleton store in downtown Portland, right across from Director Park, they're throwing DudeCon. Yes, in honor of the dude himself, the Big Lebowski. The goal is set to set the is, the goal is to set the official Guinness World Record for the most people dressed as the dude. So yeah, there's a costume contest, they'll have movie snacks, white Russians, and beer from the Big Lebowski. Just all kinds of fun. Very laid back also. The party goes from five to seven, and then McKinsey will be live there on our show. Now, Pendleton makes sweaters so you can dress like the dude, but if you really want to go all out, our favorite friend of the show, Tom Tuttle, has another fashion statement for you. So these are dude jellies. Have you seen the Big Lebowski? The Big Lebowski, he wears oh, really? jelly shoes. Oh my god, really? And apparently those actually came from Jeff Bridges' closet. Not that pair, but the pair he wears in the movie, that's what I heard. So, um, now my cousin has decided that he should sell dude jellies. And now they sell them at dudejellies.com. Oh, and, really? and they thought you would be the perfect model. Have you ever been a model, Tom Tuttle? No, I've never been a model. Well, let's go get a petty. So where do you wear these? You could wear them all over. You could wear them on a scooter. This would be cool if I start, yeah. If you started the trend? Yeah. Yeah. But then when they see, His, this is the guy that did it first. Him? He's no good. Get rid of him. Tuttle, you're delaying. What's the delay well, here? I want to know if the dude wears socks with his dude jellies. Can you Google it? Them. No socks with the dude jellies. I think the internet's going to be huge someday. People don't realize how big it's going to be. Wow, look at these. You're like, oh, look at this guy just in his normal outfit, and then boom, dude jelly. Out of nowhere, boom. You're leaving your voicemail? You're the only one I can think of to ask this question <laughs> to maybe help me out. When wearing dude jellies, would you wear socks or <laughs> would it be open toe? Here he comes. He's got his Dutch bros and his dude jellies. Here we go, ready? Ready. <laughs> okay, how do they feel? Very comfortable, they're actually very comfortable. Especially on a hot day. Definitely see wearing these on the beach. But I like the feeling of the bubble. It's like a little massage. Like oh. a little massage with every step. Oh, like a pedicure. <laughs> oh, scooter, scooter. You wanna ride a scooter with your dude jellies? That's okay. A good test. Oh yeah. I wanna see these dude jellies in action. These are gonna be perfect. Safety first, got your helmet. Yeah. Oh, okay. We'll edit that out. Here we go. Woohoo! Look at him go! Look at him go! <laughs> uh, so yeah, if you are going to DudeCon tomorrow at the Pendleton store downtown, I don't know if you can get your dude jellies in time, but if you want to hop on the Tom Tuttle trend, you can find them at DudeJellies.com. Like I said in that video, full disclosure, my cousin is the one selling those Dude Jellies. And it's also his birthday today. So, happy birthday, Adam. We'll be right back.